You remember the days of dialing up to get online? That, that was fun for absolutely no one. Well, now we have access to the internet in the palm of our hands thanks to our smartphones. We may hear that term 5G a lot, but does anyone really understand what that means? Well, what is 5G's? Well, uh, here's a guy that does. He's here to break it all down for us. Uh, Shekhar Iyer, he is the VP, EVP rather, and GM of VMware, and he's uh, here with us this morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning, thanks for having me. All right, let's get the basics out of the way because you're hearing, you know, there, there's, there was 3G, remember that, 4G. Some people are saying they're 5GE, whatever the heck that is. What is 5G? What is actually 5G? How does this work? 5G is fifth generation wireless technology. That's what it stands for. So this is a transformation that is taking place right now in terms of how the networks are being upgraded so that we as people can interact in a much richer way with each other, with our cell phones, as well as with a whole bunch of other devices and machinery. Yeah, no question. I, I know the, uh, the, the impact of 5G, it's different than 4G. 4G, you know, you had faster speeds in your phone, but ultimately you wanted to do some work, you were gonna go on to a, an actual hardwired uh, internet access. Uh, 5G, this is gonna change everything, isn't it? It is, it's gonna just transform the way we live our lives and how we interact with each other. Uh, so, for example, you can look at applications like uh, remote medicine as well as connected and intelligent cars, digital cities and smart cities. All of these are going to be made possible by this new uh, infrastructure that is going to become uh, a part of our uh, 5G upgrade. It really is uh, very interesting. Now, how far are we away from an actual 5G uh, neighborhood like where how where are we in the fight because we're hearing a lot about it but I know there's not a lot of towers out there are we looking a year out are we looking 10 years out when is this going to really affect us well this year in 2019 you're going to see um, 5g deployed in pockets by carriers like uh, Verizon and AT&T uh, as well as uh, Vodafone in the UK mm -hmm. and then over the course of the next year or two you're going to see this becoming a lot more mainstream particularly in countries like the US Mm -hmm. uh, and the rest of the globe will probably take uh, another year or two after that to become mainstream. So this is going to be happening faster than we know it. Uh, pretty big investment being made by these organizations uh, to make a splash in, in 5G as well. This is not a, not a cheap undergoing, is it? Uh, no, it, it does require significant investment. So on the one hand, uh, consumer uh, carriers as well as communication service providers, they are upgrading their networks, their spectrum, their cell towers. And then on the other hand, companies like us, VMware, as well as Dell Technologies, we are pouring in a lot of investment to make the software and hardware underneath this infrastructure that uh, gets it all working. Yeah, ultimately, it's not just putting up an antenna like, you know, trying to get our, our TV channel over the air. This is something way, way more complicated than that. And uh, you have to put a lot more of these, a lot more of these uh, towers have to be put up as well for 5G as well. Uh, 4G, you know, your existing cell towers, but now you kind of have to hide them on telephone poles, they're everywhere. They're gonna be very, you're not gonna be able to turn around and not see one probably. Yeah, absolutely. So we, well, I mean, in addition to the data rates and the speeds, you're gonna have like density as well as more cell towers. Uh, and then this is just going to give us much better connectivity, both as we are sort of roaming around as well as on uh, the campuses of uh, businesses and corporate campuses. Absolutely. So where can we get more information to see how the software is kind of tying this all together? So you can go to our website, uh, telco.vmware.com, and we have a lot of information on there, as well as I'd have your viewers check out uh, Mobile World Congress. It's an event that's happening in... Uh, Los Angeles next week, and uh, it's where we and our, many of our peer companies are going to be out there talking about 5G. No question, a lot of 5G phones hitting the market as well. Uh, it's great having you, sir. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Thanks for having me. All right. For more information on 5G and its huge impact that's coming down the pike, visit VMware.com. VMware, proud sponsor of The Morning Blend.